We love our friends over at Utah Facial Plastics helping us look and feel our best. So today we're talking about the Nano Peel. I just tried it in September and nurse practitioner Katie Larson is joining us from UFP to walk us through this procedure in this sponsored interview. I've not talked about this on the show yet, so I'm so glad you are here to tell everybody what the Nano Peel does. So the Nano Peel is a very unique um, laser resurfacing. We think chemical peels are the only way to lose that top layer of skin, but actually we can do it with lasers. And so the Nano Peel is an erbium laser, fully ablative, and what we do is we adjust the depth that we want to take off. And so depending on the downtime that you want and what we're trying to target, whether it's fine lines, um, a little bit of pigment, just a good refresh and glow, we can go very, very superficial, make it kind of a lunchtime peel where we perform it without any numbing, or we can go a little bit deeper. We have some more downtime. So it really depends on what your goals are and what your exactly. problem areas are. And everybody has their thing, whether it is the fine lines or it is that maybe melasma and discoloration, but there is a laser treatment or a treatment for you. Talk us through the time it took, if it was painful, what you were wanting to achieve. So I didn't want to have time off. And that's what you and I talked about because I've done other lasers. In fact, I love the halo, but the halo, you're going to take a couple days off because of the swelling, right, Katie? Yep. The swelling and that recovery does require some more time and it's hard to get back in makeup, back to, you know, life. But this was one that I could go back to work the next day. Yes, I was a little bit swollen and yes, it did peel, but I could put makeup on it and go. Right. And so that's the benefit of a laser like this is that we can do it very quick in the office. Um, and then again, depending on the type of downtime you have, we can kind of customize, tailor it to it. The best part is that it doesn't even require pre-numbing. We didn't even numb you. We brought you in. We hold a cold air fan kind of over your face. We're able to do that treatment really fast and then get you right back to work. So if somebody gets the Nano, what Nisha just got, do they then do a series or do they do it along with maybe some peels or other lasers? Do you have a whole combination of things? Yeah, the Nano Peel can be customized. And so a lot of the times what we'll end up doing is we want to do it in a series. So we do multiples of them. But if you're wanting to, we can combine it with other lasers that'll enhance those results. That way, maybe with your downtime on the halo, instead of it being quite as aggressive to get that top layer fully peeling with the halo, we'll use that nano peel, or we can do a little bit of a deeper setting to get some of those lines around the mouth where we're not going full strength, fully ablative in terms of aquaphor Vaseline gross recovery, but we can still get those types of results. All right, Katie, who is this for? And what are the benefits of the okay. Nano? What will I notice over the next several weeks? This laser is literally for anyone. Every skin type, every skin condition, it doesn't matter. And typically what you start to notice is you get that type of peeling. It's like a chemical peel where you lose that top layer of skin, but I'm killing it all at once. And so once that skin sloughs away, the body has been signaled in a way that it thinks it's a bigger injury. Collagen starts being produced. You get this more radiant shine and glow. You'll notice your skin is tighter, more firm, helps a lot with little fine lines, wrinkles, especially around the eyes. And those improvements should continue to come up until about six weeks out. And then at that point, if you need to, we can retreat again. The lasers that exist now are so incredible. I did the halo with you when I was on maternity leave. And from then I've been doing Moxie, my issues being the discoloration, the yes. melasma. And I tell you guys, every time I see you, it took it away. Is that interesting? We each have different ideas of what we're going in for because mine is mine are the fine lines and some deep lines too that are starting to show. And this took care of those. Yeah, it's great. And the best part is that again, we can just customize all of it and we can, you know, we have so many lasers available to us and we have the ability to customize, tailor it to what your skin concerns are. And then keep in mind, what is your downtime looking like? And based on that, we can really give you a good regimen and find ways to help your skin. And not only that, it's great for preventative. Um, we should talk about that too, because I went into my dermatologist after and we were looking for sunspots. And he said, you are so smart to consistently do laser and chemical peels because it takes those precancerous cells off. It sloughs them off. Yes, and so when it comes to those precancerous, as long as you have approval from your dermatologist, I can go in and we can treat all of those with a peel like this. And sometimes that's a much better option than doing something else like those chemical peels that maybe your dermatologist would offer or even some of the where you burn and freeze those areas off. So I this is a way to get cosmetic results as well. I just think that's so important that you both say that so viewers know 
again, what it does right. and what a good thing it is so that you're not scared about it anymore. And again, it's going to go deep or surface depending on your face. What about texture? If you're like, oh, it's uneven, it's bumpy somewhere, can that smooth out? This is great for texture. And that's the thing. Is it anything you would use microneedling for or regular chemical peels for? The nano peel or the micro peel are a great way to go. Great options because we can tackle that superficial texture and we can stimulate that tissue the same way those would with actually better results and less downtime. So if you have questions, you're thinking, I wanna ask Katie about my skin. Would this work for me? Utah Facial Plastics has their big anniversary event coming up. They do this every single November. It's on November 7th in the Draper location. Biggest deals of the year that night. There's food, there's drink, there are giveaways. And again, you get to meet all the providers and find out about all the services. So please go to their website for more information, utahfacialplastics.com. Dina, you and I are going to that, right? Oh, we love that. Yes, every year. we'll be it's there. So it's we fun. Love Katie. It's a party. It's it a party. Katie, thank plus you. you get great deals. I'm suddenly 27 again. I don't know. I don't know <laughs> what happened. <laughs> thank you, Katie. Yeah.